go. Here we go. All Here we right. go. Watch your step. Why did you move to Vegas? Honestly, the city itself, it's so unique. The city is a lot bigger than just the Strip. I mean, downtown Vegas is developing a lot. The, the life outside of the Strip is just pretty normal, I would say. Which, as we bring candidates in, you know, that's always the thing that surprises them as they come down and then when we take them out, you know, outside of the Strip, this is where you can live, this is where your mm -hmm. kids can go to school. The Red Rock Canyon, which is just west of us, Lake Mead, east of us. The coast is four hours away, the mountains for hiking, for skiing. I mean, it's, it's a, a great place. So as we go higher, you know, these are part of the empire. So you've got Caesar's Palace, you've got the Flamingo, you've got the Link, there's the Coliseum. As you look on the Rio, we are literally sitting center strip. And for the most part, everything that you can see, that is part of the Caesars Entertainment world. Sometimes I wake up in the morning and I can't even believe that I'm actually paid to think about cool stuff to do in a city like this. It's absolutely incredible. Did you always want to be working in an area where you're a challenge and you have to be willing to kind of step out there and take a risk. One advantage that a company of this size offers is that you have the opportunity to move around from hotels to entertainment to gaming to food and beverage. I mean, we, we have it all. Yeah, so I'm, a, I'm an accountant by training and now I run corporate human resources. I started at the front desk um, working graveyard. 11 years later I'm in recruiting corporate talent. I know that we're a very guest-centric company, but the employees on the back end are what make it run. And I, and I really do appreciate the fact that really making sure that your employees are in a, in a happy place, that you're okay waking up in the morning and coming to work every day.